Welcome to Trek Tales, where we journey through time and space to bring history to life. Today, we'll be stepping back in time and meandering through the cobblestone streets of Europe's most historically rich cities. This is not just any list. We've handpicked 10 cities that stand out for their historical significance, their well-preserved historical sites, museums, and not to mention their profound cultural heritage. We'll be exploring cities that have seen empires rise and fall, cities that have been the birthplace of revolutions, and cities that have stood the test of time, carrying stories from the past into the present. So, history buffs, this one's for you. From the ancient ruins of Rome to the vibrant cultural heritage of Istanbul, we're about to embark on a journey that will take us across the breadth and depth of Europe's historical landscape. Pack your virtual bags and get ready to embark on this historical journey across Europe. Our first stop is Rome, the Eternal City. Time may pass and civilizations may crumble, but Rome remains steadfast and unyielding. This city is a testament to the grandeur of the past. As we peel back the layers of time, we discover a city steeped in history, stretching back over two and a half thousand years. Rome was not built in a day, and indeed, its history spans epochs. From its mythical founding by Romulus in the eighth century BC, through the rise and fall of the Roman Empire to its current status as the vibrant capital of Italy. Every corner of this city echoes with tales of emperors and gladiators, senators and slaves. One cannot discuss Rome without mentioning the Colosseum, this magnificent amphitheater, once the stage for gladiatorial contests and public spectacles. The structure stands as a towering testament to the architectural and engineering prowess of the ancient Romans. It's said that the roar of the crowd and the clash of swords can still be heard if you listen closely enough. A stone's throw away from the Colosseum lies the Roman Forum, the beating heart of the ancient city. Here, in this sprawling complex of ruins, you can almost hear the impassioned speeches of Roman senators, the bustling marketplace, and the daily life of ancient Romans. And let's not forget the Pantheon, the best preserved monument from ancient Rome. This architectural marvel with its massive dome and oculus was dedicated to all the gods of pagan Rome. Its grandeur and scale are a constant reminder of Rome's illustrious past. Rome is more than just a city. It's a living, breathing museum. Its stones and monuments whisper tales of glory and conquest, of gods and emperors. Yet it's not stuck in the past. Rome continues to evolve, its ancient history intertwined with the pulse of modern life. From the whispers of gladiators to the echoes of Roman senators, Rome truly is a living museum. Next, we journey to Athens, the cradle of Western civilization. Here, nestled between the Azure Aegean Sea and the rugged mountains, the story of mankind took a significant turn. This is where democracy was born, where the first seeds of philosophical thought sprouted, and where theater as we know it was conceived. Athens has been continuously inhabited for over 7,000 years, making it one of the world's oldest cities. Its history is a rich tapestry of cultural evolution, political innovation, and intellectual discovery, entwined with legendary tales of gods and heroes. The city's pivotal role in the development of democracy is indisputable. It was here, in the 5th century BC, that the concept of rule by the people, or demos, was first implemented by statesman Cleisthenes. This revolutionary idea of governance, where each citizen had a voice, was a radical departure from the monarchies and oligarchies of the time. Athens is often referred to as the birthplace of philosophy. This is where great thinkers like Socrates, Plato, and Aristotle questioned the nature of the world and human existence, laying the foundations for Western philosophical thought. 
Their profound insights continue to shape our understanding of ethics, politics, science, and art. The city's contribution to the arts is epitomized by its invention of theater. The ancient Athenians were the first to stage dramatic performances as part of their religious festivals. The tragedies of Sophocles and the comedies of Aristophanes, performed in the open-air theaters of Athens, were the precursors to the diverse range of theatrical genres we enjoy today. A visit to Athens would be incomplete without exploring its iconic landmarks, the Acropolis, the Parthenon, and the ancient Agora. These architectural marvels, perched atop the city's hills, stand as proud testimonials to Athens' glorious past, its enduring legacy, and its influence on Western civilization. In Athens, ancient philosopher's wisdom still echoes through the marbled ruins. The city's timeless allure lies in its ability to weave the threads of history into the fabric of the present, inviting us to reflect on our shared human journey. Now we find ourselves in the city of light, beautiful Paris. This captivating city, nestled along the Seine River, has been a beacon of culture, art, and history for centuries. Let's journey back to the Middle Ages, when Paris was a bustling hub of trade and intellectual pursuit. The city was already renowned for its architectural marvels, the most famous being the Notre Dame Cathedral. This Gothic masterpiece, with its intricate carvings and awe-inspiring stained glass windows, has witnessed centuries of history, from the coronation of Napoleon Bonaparte to the liberation of Paris in 1944. Fast forward to the 18th century, and Paris becomes the epicenter of radical change. The French Revolution, a period marked by political and social upheaval, forever altered the course of history. The storming of the Bastille, the execution of Louis XVI, the reign of terror, these events unfolded right here on the streets of Paris. Today, Place de la Concorde stands as a reminder of the revolution's tumultuous past, its obelisk marking the spot where the guillotine once stood. Beyond the city limits, the opulent Palace of Versailles beckons. Once the royal residence of Louis XIV, the Sun King, it's a testament to the absolute monarchy of the Ancien Regime. Its hall of mirrors, grand gardens, and ornate chambers tell tales of extravagant court life, political intrigue, and the eventual downfall of the French monarchy. Then there's the Louvre, a monument to the world's artistic and cultural heritage. Once a royal palace, it now houses thousands of works of art, including the enigmatic Mona Lisa and the majestic Venus de Milo. But Paris is more than its past. It's a city that, despite wars and revolutions, has managed to reinvent itself time and again. It's a city where history meets modernity, where every street corner, every cafe, every cobblestone has a story to tell. Paris, a symbol of revolution, resilience, and romance, never fails to fascinate. From its medieval roots to its revolutionary spirit, the City of Light continues to shine, an eternal testament to the enduring allure of history. Crossing the English Channel, we arrive in London, a city steeped in history. From its Roman origins to its pivotal role in the British Empire, London has always been a significant player on the world stage. Our journey through time begins with Londinium, established by the Romans around 2,000 years ago. Over centuries, it evolved from a minor outpost on the edge of the empire into a bustling cosmopolitan city. Today, remnants of the Roman wall still stand as a silent testament to London's ancient roots. Fast forward to the medieval era, and we're greeted by the formidable Tower of London. A castle, a royal palace, a prison, and even a zoo, the tower's roles have been as varied as its history is long. Here, one can almost hear the whispers of monarchs, prisoners, and beef eaters echoing through the centuries. A stone's throw away, the River Thames flows, bearing witness to London's evolution. Once a lifeline for the city, it has seen Viking invasions, 
the Great Fire of London, and the construction of iconic landmarks such as the Tower Bridge. Speaking of landmarks, no historical tour of London would be complete without a visit to the British Museum. Home to a staggering 8 million works, it provides a panoramic view of human history, culture, and art. From the Rosetta Stone to the Elgin Marbles, the museum is a treasure trove of stories from across the globe. Our final destination is the venerable Westminster Abbey. This Gothic masterpiece has witnessed countless coronations, royal weddings, and funerals. Walking through its hallowed halls, one can't help but feel a sense of awe and reverence for the history that unfolded here. London, a city where history and modernity coexist, always has a tale to tell. Whether it's the Roman wall whispering of ancient times, the Tower of London recounting tales of power and intrigue, or the British Museum showcasing humanity's shared past, London is a city that invites you to step back in time and explore the rich tapestry of its history. Our next stop is Berlin, a city with a turbulent yet transformative history. Berlin, the capital city of Germany, has a history that is as fascinating as it is complex. From its origins as a medieval trading post to its rise as the capital of the Kingdom of Prussia, Berlin has always been a city of significance. But it was in the 20th century that Berlin truly took center stage in world history. During the Second World War, Berlin was the nerve center of Adolf Hitler's Third Reich. The city bore witness to some of the darkest moments in human history, but also saw the heroic efforts of those who resisted the Nazi regime. Today, the city still bears the scars of this tumultuous period, with sites like the Topography of Terror and the Holocaust Memorial serving as somber reminders of the past. But Berlin's history didn't stop in 1945. The city became a flashpoint of the Cold War divided by the infamous Berlin Wall. The wall not only physically separated East and West Berlin, but also symbolized the ideological divide between communism and democracy. Today, remnants of the wall, including the East Side Gallery, stand as powerful reminders of a city divided. Yet Berlin is not just a city of war and division. It's a city of resilience and reinvention. The Brandenburg Gate, once a symbol of division, now stands as a beacon of unity and peace. Checkpoint Charlie, once a tense border crossing, is now a tourist spot that commemorates the city's Cold War history. Berlin's history is a potent mix of triumph and tragedy, of division and unity. It's a city that has been shaped by the events of the past, but refuses to be defined by them. It's a city that has learned from its history and used it to build a better future. Berlin, a city that rose from its ashes, stands as a testament to resilience. In the face of adversity, Berlin has not only survived, but thrived, becoming a vibrant, cosmopolitan city that is a must visit for any history buff. Now we reach the crossroads of Europe and Asia, mesmerizing Istanbul. A city that has been the capital of three different empires, Istanbul has a rich and vibrant history that is woven into every inch of its streets and architecture. Our journey begins in the ancient times when Istanbul was known as Byzantium, a city founded by Greek colonists in the 7th century BC. As Byzantium, it was a prosperous city due to its strategic location on the trade routes between Europe and Asia. Later, in the 4th century AD, the Roman Emperor Constantine the Great made the city his capital, renaming it Constantinople. Under the Romans, the city flourished, becoming a hub of art, culture, and Christianity. The magnificent Hagia Sophia, a cathedral built during this era, stands as a testament to the city's Roman past. Its imposing dome and intricate mosaics are a marvel to behold, and the building itself is a symbol of the city's rich religious history, having served as a church, a mosque, and now a museum. Under the Ottoman Empire, the city was renamed Istanbul, 
and transformed into an Islamic hub. During this period, Istanbul saw the construction of the Blue Mosque, a stunning piece of architecture that is still an active place of worship. Its six minarets and cascading domes are an iconic part of the Istanbul skyline. Another key historical site is the Topkapi Palace, the primary residence of the Ottoman sultans for over 400 years. This sprawling complex, with its opulent courts and lush gardens, offers a glimpse into the lavish lifestyle of the Ottoman elite. Istanbul's history is a tapestry of different cultures, religions and empires, all of which have left their mark on this unique city. From the ancient walls of Byzantium to the bustling bazaars of the Ottoman era, Istanbul is a city where history comes alive. In Istanbul, every stone tells a story of empires risen and fallen. The city stands as a testament to the enduring power of human civilization, a place where the past and present coexist in a beautiful harmony. It's a place that captures the imagination, a city that truly deserves its place on any history buff's bucket list. Next, we travel to Vienna, the city of music and dreams. This Austrian capital, once the heart of the mighty Habsburg Empire, has been a cultural epicenter for centuries. Vienna's rich history is imbued with the legacy of great composers like Mozart, Beethoven and Schubert, who once walked its cobbled streets. The city's vibrant musical heritage is still very much alive in its world-class opera houses, concert halls and annual music festivals. But Vienna's cultural wealth extends beyond music. It's also a city of stunning architecture, from the grandeur of the Baroque to the elegance of the secession. One cannot talk about Vienna without mentioning the magnificent Schönbrunn Palace, the former summer residence of the Habsburgs. Its grand Baroque architecture and expansive gardens are a testament to the opulence of the Habsburg era. Equally captivating is St. Stephen's Cathedral, a Gothic masterpiece that towers over the city. Its intricately carved stone facade and colorful tiled roof are a sight to behold. Another iconic symbol of Vienna's cultural heritage is the Vienna State Opera. Known for its world-class performances, the Opera House is a beacon of the city's enduring love for music. Vienna, a city where history and culture harmonize, is truly a symphony for the senses. From the echoes of classical music wafting through its streets to the awe-inspiring architecture that graces its skyline, Vienna is a city that continues to enchant and inspire. As we leave the city of music and dreams, we carry with us the melodies of its rich history and the promise of its vibrant future. We now find ourselves in Madrid, the vibrant capital of Spain. Originally a small medieval town, Madrid has evolved into a bustling metropolis, teeming with life and culture. It's a city that seamlessly blends the old with the new, where narrow, winding streets give way to grand boulevards and modern skyscrapers. Madrid's rich cultural heritage is particularly evident in the arts. The city is home to the Prado Museum, one of the world's most prestigious art museums boasting an impressive collection of European art from the 12th to the early 20th century. Here, you can find masterpieces by Spanish masters like Velázquez and Goya, alongside works by other European greats like Rubens and Tidian. Not to be missed is the Royal Palace of Madrid, a magnificent example of 18th century Baroque architecture. This opulent palace with its lavishly decorated rooms and beautiful gardens is a testament to the grandeur of the Spanish monarchy. Another iconic landmark is the Retiro Park, a green oasis in the heart of the city. Once a royal retreat, the park is now a popular spot for locals and tourists alike, offering a tranquil escape from the bustling city. Madrid, a city that pulsates with life and history, is a canvas of Spanish culture. From the echoes of flamenco music wafting through its streets to the awe-inspiring art that adorns its museums, 
Madrid is a city that continues to inspire and captivate. As we leave the vibrant Spanish capital, we carry with us the rhythms of its rich culture and the promise of its dynamic future. As we leave the vibrant landscapes of Madrid, we embark on a journey to Lisbon, the city of seven hills. Bathed in the golden light of the setting sun, Lisbon, Portugal's capital, is a city that evokes an air of romantic nostalgia. Once a major maritime power during the Age of Discovery, Lisbon's rich history is reflected in its architecture, culture, and spirit. As we wander through the narrow cobbled streets of the historic district of Alfama, we're transported back in time. The district's unique architectural style, with its charming houses adorned with azulejos, traditional painted ceramic tiles, is a testament to the city's Moorish past. The city's skyline is dominated by the imposing São Jorge Castle. This unseen fortress, perched atop one of Lisbon's highest hills, offers breathtaking views of the city and the Tagus River. Another iconic landmark is the Belém Tower, a UNESCO World Heritage Site. This fortified tower, built in the 16th century, served as a point of embarkation and disembarkation for Portuguese explorers. Nearby, the Geronimos Monastery, another UNESCO World Heritage Site, stands as a stunning example of Manuelan architecture, a style unique to Portugal. As we wander through its grand cloisters, we're reminded of Portugal's golden age of exploration. Lisbon, a city where history and beauty blend seamlessly, is a treasure trove of discoveries. As we leave the city of Seven Hills, the melodies of Fado, the soulful music of Portugal, echo in our minds, a haunting reminder of Lisbon's enduring charm and beauty. Our final stop before the conclusion of our historical journey takes us to Prague, the city of a hundred spires. Nestled in the heart of Central Europe, Prague, the capital of the Czech Republic, has been a political, cultural, and economic hub for over a millennium. Founded in the 9th century, the city has witnessed the rise and fall of empires, the horrors of war, and the jubilation of revolution. Prague's architecture is a visual symphony, a blend of styles spanning centuries, from the Gothic grace of the St. Vitus Cathedral to the Cubist designs found in the city's lesser-known corners, Prague is an architectural gem. Our first stop is Prague Castle. This sprawling complex, which dates back to the 9th century, is the largest ancient castle in the world. It has served as the seat of power for kings of Bohemia, Roman emperors, and presidents of Czechoslovakia. Today, it is the official office of the President of the Czech Republic. Within the castle's walls, we find the St. Vitus Cathedral, an excellent example of Gothic architecture, its spires reaching toward the sky. We then make our way to the Charles Bridge, a historic stone bridge that crosses the Vltava River. Lined with statues of Catholic saints, the bridge has long been a symbol of the city. From here, we have a stunning view of the city's skyline, a sea of red roofs and spires. Our journey concludes with a visit to the Old Town Square, where we find the astronomical clock. Installed in 1410, it is the third oldest astronomical clock in the world, and the oldest one still operating. Every hour, crowds gather to watch The Walk of the Apostles, a mechanical performance that has been enchanting viewers for centuries. Prague, a city where history is etched in every stone, is a living testament to the past. As we leave the city, we carry with us the echoes of its rich history, a poignant reminder of the indelible marks left by time. As we conclude our historical journey, we hope these cities have kindled your curiosity and sparked a desire to learn more about them. Each city is a treasure to be discovered. We encourage you to delve deeper into the rich tapestry of history these cities offer, whether it be by pacing their streets, reading about past, or watching a documentary. Remember, these are not just reminders of the past. They are living dynamic entities. Their histories 
etched into their architecture, their culture, their people. As we conclude our historical journey, we hope we've ignited in you a spark to set off on your own exploration, to uncover the untold stories, the concealed narratives, the overlooked tales that dwell in the heart of these cities. And always remember, history is not just confined to the past. It's all around us, waiting to be. If you've enjoyed this trip through time and place, and you're eager for more, we ask you to please like this video and share it with fellow history enthusiasts. Your support helps us bring more of these fascinating stories to life. Don't forget to subscribe to Trek Tales, your virtual passport to the world's most intriguing historical sites. By subscribing, you'll be the first to know when we embark on our next adventure. And if you're as passionate about history as we are, make sure to hit the bell icon. You'll receive notifications every time we publish a new video. Until our next adventure, keep exploring and keep learning. This is Trek Tales, signing off.